Hello and how are you all doing today on this great great day? Um, I'm going to be really really quick. I wanted to make a, a, a minute, couple minutes video but it probably ends out to be like 10 minutes knowing what I'm like. Okay, so um, my name is Darren Miller and it's great to, to meet some of you. If you haven't, if you don't know who I am, I've been in the app space um, and in the self publisher space now for the last two years. Um, we've also been helping um, small to medium sized businesses market their self through the app space um, and driving business combining the self-publishing together in the app world as well we've also expanded to the US so um, you obviously come here because you want to have some tips on how to um, write a children's book now I'm not going to take you through the format inside of it um, which I'm probably sure now a lot of you've clicked away from this video but I'm going to be giving you some great tips on where to get your um, images from um, and how to kind of gain some ideas as well okay so let me dig straight into this so the first place which is really really good is and you can see at the top here is sxc.hu now these images here are free and you can use them as you will as long as you follow the, the license so let's just say I wanted to get a uh, a cartoon cat let's just say cartoon cat for my list and there you go we've got a list of cartoon cats so let's just say we wanted a cartoon cat and then we wanted a clock we wanted a clock maybe the clock the cat is going to go meet the clock at, in a dark place <laughs> okay so we have here and um, we have a clock and then we have a cat that's the start of our um, our our okay so if we go here it says here there are restrictions and um, there are standard restrictions which is great and then there are other restrictions which says uh, must be notified and credited when using the photo in any public work and to be honest I don't really want to credit him so I'm gonna go and look elsewhere let's just say now let's have a look at this clock okay this one here says standard restrictions apply which means I don't need to credit him I probably will do just to say thank you very much for it but I don't need to do that so then I can use this clock I will click on download you do have to set up an account with these guys here it's free anyway we all love free just so set up that set it up download it um, and then let's go to the cat let's see where the cat is um, there's no restrictions on the cat meow <laughs> we can use the cat apologize for the um, dodgy um, dodgy voices um, so you can use the cat download that um, and then you would upload a uh, you'll bring up the word document the old-fashioned style that I like to call it and then you have your your you say you have your clock here and then you would say wow you know what a clock you know um, what is the time mr clock or something very random you know whatever images you get just write something you don't need to make it long you know it could be one sentence very very simple very very simple and then you add your image there and then you add your other image so you want about you know 10 maybe 10 to, to 12 um, 12 I would say pages when you're creating when you're creating it okay another place that you can go to um, let's go here let's go back is called creativecommons.org okay it is a, a place where you can get licenses or ever in the public domain or whatever you wherever you can get them um, and my computer has um, frozen if you bear with me a moment I'm sure it will kick it kick itself into gear okay then you go to licenses you click on find license um, and then you would click on to let's say let's go to cartoon dog let's say and then let's say we go to Google images Let, probably there's none there but hopefully there is just makes it a lot easier ah we have some images and then we have loads of cartoon dogs click on one and then just make sure you check the standard uh, license agreement and then you can do that when you're going through the free options you probably have to take a few extra steps now I'm going to give you a paid option is called 123RF so let's say we wanted to go to cartoon house because the cat and dog need to go and live somewhere right and then we have some houses um, and let's say um, we want 
we don't want the house burning down. It's a lovely cold day. It's Christmas time. Christmas time. Okay, you don't want to hear my voice singing. And then, I don't know why it's not clicking. Okay, there we go. And then um, what we'll do now, the image is there. Probably they start from like one dollar and they range up to like seventy dollars, depending on the kind of um, contract. Um, sorry, depending on the kind of license in that you want. Um, generally speaking, the, the type of license that you'd be using, because it will be within an ebook or a front cover of an app, um, you want a standard. But definitely take a look at the license agreement. Um, and then I can find the licensing agreement somewhere du -du -du. okay there we have here so we have standard and you find out what the standard license is here or s extended license and you find out so you can see you know you can buy your points your credits um, depending on I think one credit is one dollar or maybe one credit is is uh, 50, 50 cents so just have a look at that and 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 do that now when you're obviously creating your your kindle book it can be a bit of a pain because you know you want to get the formatting right and if you upload it and the person downloads it buys it and downloads it and then has this formatting all over the place that is pretty crap so that is a thing of the past what i'm offering not now um on the 24th of january um which is on a thursday and as at 2 p.m eastern standard time UK time is 7 p.m. and if you click over to here which is Facebook forward slash Avea Publishing LTD I am releasing a comprehensive course that actually combines Kindle and mobile application together so you can actually distribute that same book content through multiple platforms because some people don't like Kindles and some people watch their you know read their Kindles on their iPhone um, or on their Android you know so you want to kind of cater and market to both people and not only that you can make more money by doing that so that is what I'm going to be showing you not only that I want to teach the community because I've been in that space for such a long time and again the, the, the Kindle space for a long time everything has been changing uh, so we as a community you know I want to show you how to do this and you're probably thinking oh my god I've got to build an app that's difficult don't worry about that because we are building a software that actually does the coding for you so you don't even need to do that and also the ebook creator does it all for you so you're literally clicking playing and typing in your book which is really really simple and that's all you're doing I mean it, it sounds crazy but it's true it's going to be on Kickstarter this Thursday so um, I should say 24th because you may see this video after Thursday and it's going to be running for 30 days so take a look at that there if you like this video thumbs up come over to the Facebook page if you didn't like it thumbs down post in the comment why you didn't like it so at least I can you know come back with a comeback video so I can at least defend myself okay guys so anyway take it easy enjoy your day